Hello, I am Dr. D.A. Satish, Senior Consultant Dermatologist, practicing at Skin Cosmetic and ENT Care Center, Jayanagar, Bangalore for the last 40 years. Superficial fungal infections are very common conditions which are encountered in our day-to-day -day practice. They are called dermatophyte or DNA infections. Depending upon the location of the lesions, different names are given. For example, when it occurs in the scalp, it's called tinea capitis and it is quite common in children. When it occurs in the face, it's called tinea fasciae. When it occurs in the body, it's called tinea corporis. Hands, manum, feet, pedis. When it occurs in the groins, it's called tinea cruris or adobesic. And sometimes the nails can also be affected when it's called tinea unguium. Tinea infections can spread from person to person by direct contact or by contact with fomites like clothes, pencils, caps, shower caps or other formats used by the patients. It is very common in hostels and dormitories. Clinically, tinea infections manifest as very itchy, ring-shaped or annular lesions and as I said before, it can occur in different areas of the body and it can spread if untreated quite widely and it can be often resistant to treat. There are some general instructions which you have to follow when you are diagnosed with a superficial fungal infections. Keep the area dry. Wash your clothes separately. Don't put it in the washing machine. After washing, you have to dry it in the sun. And after you dry the clothes, reverse the clothes, iron it and wear it. Always see to it that other members of the family are also treated. You should always follow the instructions of the dermatologist. Whatever medicines are prescribed, both topical and systemic, has to be taken for a proper duration and the adequate dose so that you get a good cure because resistant and recurrent infections are quite common in tinea patients. Remember that you should never self-medicate and never use topical or systemic steroids because that leads to a lot of side effects. So if you are diagnosed with fungal infections, do not get scared, do not panic. Consult your dermatologist, take proper treatment and get cured. Thank you.